First things first, before I get this video started, I kind of want to apologize because the camera quality is not that good. So right now I'm filming with my GoPro, which is a little bit better than what I was filming with on Sunday. I don't know why I didn't just film with this in the first place, but yeah, I just want to get that out of the way. And second of all, I didn't film as much as I'd like to. You know, I'm not used to walking around with a camera filming everything I do, every little thing and talking to it, so it's a little bit awkward for the first time. So I apologize for that as well. So what I'm going to do at the end of the video. I'm kind of going to give you guys like a walkthrough and a breakdown of everything we did and just talk and explain everything and just every like in detail so you guys understand better and so everything just flows together and ties in so it makes for an okay video. Alright yeah so with that being said I hope you guys enjoy and let's get right into the video. South Florida, and it's just freezing. So the plan is, we're gonna go down to Sanibel, me and my girlfriend, and we're just gonna see if we can smack them. See if we can hook up some stuff, and hopefully it's gonna be a good day, a good cold day. All right, so 43 degrees, and that is freezing here for South Florida. I'm wearing three layers. I got a hoodie, a jacket, and then a long sleeve on. So it's gonna be fun. It's gonna. Be <laughs> It's gonna be a real adventure. And then, yeah. Let's just see. Okay, it is freezing outside. Alright guys, so we just got to the parking here at Sandoval, right by the Sandoval Cathedral Bridge. We just paid for parking, so now we have to go walk to the spot. And so it should be about like a half an hour walk, we're hoping. So, yeah, everything's good so far. Still freezing outside there. Catch y'all later. So I just got this pretty nice sheep's head. And sheep's head have pretty much been like what's been munching the most. As you can see, it's a pretty nice one. Not the biggest one of the day. And just like that. Yay! Alright, yeah, so like I said, not a lot of footage at all really. Alright, so today is January 3rd. I went fishing on December 31st. So with that being said, Happy New Year's, so story time. So yeah, we started the day off pretty early. I woke up at 4.30, we left the house at 5.30. So that hour gave us enough time to eat breakfast. You know, we got my bags packed, we got the rod situated. So everything was good, we were ready to leave. And it's about a one hour drive from my house to Sanibel. So that gave us enough time to get first light. We didn't want to waste time. We just wanted to get there as early as possible and just fish pretty much. So we're driving to Sanibel and then we get on the island and first things first was bait. I like Wendy's, I've been there before. I've gotten my bait from there a couple times. And the cool thing was actually, I only asked for three dozen shrimp and I probably walked out with an extra three dozen in my bucket and he didn't charge me extra. So I was like, okay, this is awesome. I have more shrimp that I know what to do with. So yeah, we get the bait. We keep driving north on the island. So the thing with that spot, you can't park there or anywhere like in the vicinity because it's all just houses or private property. So we had to drive an extra maybe like two minutes north on the island, an extra mile to the parking spot, which was the Santa Cativa Bridge. And as you guys can see, I vlogged a little bit there and you couldn't see my face because it was the camera was this close to my body, but it's okay. We ended up paying for parking, which kind of sucked. 
and we had to walk, which sucked even more. But I mean, everything worked out. We get to the spot pretty early, and yeah, we just started fishing pretty much. We got there maybe like yeah, seven ten. First bite wasn't until maybe seven thirty, and it was my girlfriend. She got the first fish. It was a little mangrove snapper, maybe about that big. She was excited. Maybe after like two hours of just purely mangrove snappers, I started getting tired of it. I'm like, okay, I'm done. Where's, when's the real fish gonna come through here? And maybe about like half an hour afterwards, we get the first sheep's head bite. And it was, it was an okay, it was an okay sheep's head. You know, at that point, I'm excited. I'm like, okay, finally, um, sheep's head. You know, I love sheep's head. They're really fun to catch. They, they give out really good fights for their size. And from that bite forward, the whole day was just purely sheep's head. Nothing but pure sheep's head. And it was, it was a really fun day. It made up for a really fun day. A lot of good fights. A lot of good stolen shrimp. The flash forward about like four hours and now we're fishing the bridge and then we're casting like into the slots under the bridge and then that's where a lot of bites came from that too. So yeah, about maybe 12 o'clock and then maybe 12.30, like I said, I was just looking for snook the whole day. I just wanted to get a snook bite going on. So yeah, about 12.30 and then all of a sudden I feel thunk on the end of my line and I'm used to the whole day just sheep that they nibble. It's, you know, they try to steal your bait and then out of nowhere I just feel a thunk. I feel like boom, and then a pull, and I'm like, oh, that's not a sheep's head. It's pull and drag like crazy, and I'm like, finally, okay, I got a decent snook on, a little, maybe like 24-incher. And then out of nowhere, a huge, like, huge dinner plate sheep's head, and I'm like, this is awesome. You know, I was just, I was a little disappointed, because it wasn't my snook, but it fought like one, so I was like, this is awesome. And then I took a quick picture of it, as you can see here. So finally, like, a decent fish after a whole day of just, like, little dinks pretty much so all in all it was a really fun day lots of fish lots of frozen fingers and yeah that's about it guys i had fun my girlfriend had fun she caught her first sheep head so that was cool too so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed our first vlog i'll catch you guys later on the next video